Hey, how's it going everyone? This is DCSG81 and yes, today I'm very excited to be taking a look into this latest Nota Studio, the Spider-Man drones as well as a battle damage versions. And yes, this is one that I have been anticipating for because I have seen some promo pictures previously and it looks very very good and I kind of have confidence in Nota Studio into making this looking equally good because of their recent release like the Logan uh, or even the previous Steve Rogers has been pretty impressive so I kind of hope that they will do justice to these two okay so without further ado let's open them up okay so I'll take a look into the normal versions which is also the clean versions yep as you guys know I have not opened it up before this is my very first time wow take a look at that this looks pretty good yikes wow Whew. it's pretty heavy I mean there is some weight there I was expecting it to be hollow and light but this one does have some weight impressive okay let's take a closer look of it wow the details are pretty amazing I never thought that they will put so much details into it this is nice is there any articulations <laughs> I believe not but it looks very very good almost as if it's just like in a movie goodness goodness wow this is very nice let's see what else it comes with there's a I think this is a stand yeah I believe this is a stand it comes with it yep there's a hole there so I believe it should be packed right in yep interesting and it doesn't really stand <laughs> okay maybe i put it the wrong way let's try it this way yeah i put it the wrong way <laughs> sorry about that <laughs> very nice indeed okay let's take a look at the better damaged ones okay. i believe it's the same just maybe some scratches some damages there yep let's take a look yeah exactly like what i expected just a few scratches here and there uh yeah just like i think they just put it on the floor and just <laughs> scratch it for this one to become like this yeah but it's very very impressive okay wow there's a lot of scratches marks all over and i was expecting maybe some damage like something was broken but it does not okay yeah let's compare two by two yep looking pretty good there of course it's not selling by set i actually bought one each just for my own preference you can actually just buy the the clean one or you can just buy the damaged one as many as you like or should i say as many as you can afford and yeah so so it doesn't really like you know restrict you you must get one better damage or one clean one things like that okay it's just my preference okay so the stand works like this okay wow this is indeed very very nice okay yeah i was hoping that i think the normal uh tamashi stand or uh maybe mayfax stand should works on it yeah maybe i should try some of it okay so right over here i have the tamashi nation stand the bandai stand I have the Mayfax stand as well as a Figma stand. Okay, <laughs> let's try and see which one it works. Okay, let's hope it works on all of it. <laughs> okay, let's try for the Tamashi stand. Uh, yes, it does kind of fit, but you do need to use a little force to push it in. I think the hole the pack hole is a little bit small on this one so you just need to push slightly in and then it will just fit on yes so it does works okay very nice and let's try on the mayfax stand this time okay i think mayfax no the mayfax one doesn't work because the pack is too huge yeah, i just can't go in and let's try on the figma okay oh. yes same like the Tamashi Nation stand, Figma one does works, but you need to push it. Oh, <laughs> it goes right all the way in. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. So it does works for Figma stand as well. 
Okay, since this drone doesn't come with any accessories or even any articulations, I will proceed straight to the size comparisons. Like always, I will start with some SHV Guard Spider-Man. I have the Homecoming Spider-Man right over here. As well as the Far From Home Spider-Man, which is the perfect suit for this because this drone comes from Far From Home. And also the Avengers Endgame. Iron Spider. And next we'll move on to some main facts. I have the Homecoming Spider-Man right over here. As well as the Infinity War Iron Spider. And lastly we also have the Comic Pain Amazing Spider-Man. And next we'll move on to some Marvel Legends. I have the Pizza Spider-Man right over here. Okay. And also the Far From Home Spider-Man And also the Mysterio Unfortunately, this is the comic version so I don't have the movie version of it But this is the classic comic version Which I believe is the exact same scale Okay, so my final verdict for these drones is I'm going to give him a 9 out of 10 Because I think it's really really detailed It looks amazing just like in the movie and also it has a lot of great tiny details and crave into it and it looks extremely real and yet another best thing is it comes with its own stand which i think is a good thought of it but in the end my only gripe is that it doesn't have any articulation i was hoping that some parts are movable at least for the guns nevertheless i do think that nota studio did a great job on these drones and i do recommend it if you see any of these in the store nearby i do recommend you to grab it and furthermore these drones aren't very expensive so if you like two you can even you know grab maybe 10 or 20 of it <laughs> to actually make a whole diorama to reenact the scenes from the last fight in far from home yes you can also use these drones as a stand for your spider-man because it does looks very cool for your spider-man to be you know standing on top of it so i do hope you like this review do me a thumbs up if you like it and of course as always do leave me any questions or any comments that you have for these drones down in the comment sections below and at the same time i hope you will check out my playlist at the top right corner and also do browse around my channel for more interesting custom reviews such as this one and i'll see you again in my next video as always take care and thank you for watching bye